When a battery has been returned for warranty, we can use the Medtronic's battery tester to determine whether the battery is faulty or not. Before connecting the tester to the battery, we first need to check the battery for any signs of physical damage or neglect from poor maintenance that could affect the test. When you have completed the pre-checks, you can now connect the tester to the battery. Connect the positive tester lead to the positive battery post. Then connect the negative tester lead to the negative battery post. Once connected, the battery's voltage reading will display. A battery with a voltage below 12.5 volts will require charging before a warranty test can be completed. To continue to the battery test, press enter. You will now have the option to select the in-vehicle or out-of-vehicle test. Using the direction keys, select the out-of-vehicle test and press enter. You will now be asked what application the battery is in. The battery we are testing is an automotive battery, select automotive and press enter. You will then be asked the battery type. Using the direction keys, you can choose the battery type you are testing. In this case, we will select the regular flooded option and press enter. The battery standard will now display. There are many options in this menu. However, in Australia, batteries are rated in CCA or cold cranking amps. Select CCA and press the enter key. The battery rating or CCA of the battery will now need to be programmed into the tester. Find the CCA rating on the battery and once located, use the directional keys to input the CCA and press enter. The tester will now analyse the battery's condition and give you a result. There are five result messages that may display. Good battery, good in recharge, charge and retest, replace battery, bad cell replace. Once the battery test is complete, you can print out the battery test result and remove the tester leads from the battery to end the test.